Hi, my name is Paige and I'm the Family Programs Coordinator at the Harm Museum of Art. The exhibition Dream and Alice, Maggie Taylor Through the Looking Glass, illustrates Lewis Carroll's fantastic story of Alice traveling through a mirror into a new dreamlike world. Maggie Taylor captures the magic of Alice's adventures by creating landscapes layered with interesting color combinations. Today, we'll learn how to paint your very own imaginative world inside of a mere reflective surface and experiment with mixing colors to make new out of this world shades. Let's get started! You'll need a few supplies. First, you'll need a sheet of cardboard or any hard surface, next to a piece of aluminum foil, tape, a selection of paints, I'm using acrylic mat, dish soap, water, paint brushes, and Q-tips. Our first step is to take our piece of foil and to tape it down to our sheet of cardboard. We we'll want to make sure that the shiny side of the aluminum foil is face side up. This will make our reflection for our mirror-like surface. You can work as small or as large as you'd like, as long as your aluminum foil sheet fits your cardboard backing. Next, we'll prepare our paint. You'll place a little drop of dish soap into each paint color. The dish soap helps with the paint spreading and sitting on your aluminum foil. If you don't have dish soap, the activity will still work. The paint will just be a little flaky when it dries. I'm using Q-tips to mix the paint and the dish soap together. Now I'm ready to paint. I'll take my paintbrush and I'll choose a variety of colors to spread all across my reflective surface. Oh, looks like we have a friend joining us for our art at home activity. Gee, the cat can be creative too. So I'm taking my paintbrush and I'm applying paint all across my reflective surface, watching how the paint interacts with the aluminum foil. I'm mixing some of my favorite colors together to make my own interesting shades. Mix color combinations you love most to create your own Imagining Wonderland landscape. With a Q-tip, I'm drawing right on top of my colored background landscape. I'm using the Q-tip to pull the paint off the reflective surface so I can see the shiny aluminum foil underneath. Be creative with your own design. I change out my Q-tip from time to time just to make sure that it's not becoming overly saturated with paint. Use your imagination to create an interesting landscape of your own. Have fun with reflections and interesting color combinations.